be very careful about how we interpret what we read, especially the Bible. And I'll tell you why. When I research these secret societies, and I research the Bible, and by the way, I'm a Christian, so if you're a Christian, don't think I'm knocking your religion. I'm not. I'm just telling you what I found. I have found that at the very heart and core of all these secret societies lurks the Kabbalah. The Kabbalah is the ancient Jewish mysticism. It is a method of encoding information through a system of mathematics and numbers. It is some of the most ancient knowledge that man has ever possessed and has been kept secret and given only to those who have proven themselves worthy through the process of initiation. Nobody knows where it comes from. I can tell you this, it was there long before the Jews came along. The Jews just took it and preserved it, and they passed it down, and it's used by everybody. Because it's at the heart and core of the secret knowledge, the metaphysics, the real science that none of us know anything about. These people that belong to the secret societies never dared to write down in any language what they knew, what it was that they were guarding. Because then someone could steal it, and then the secret would be out. So they devised secret systems of encoding the secrets of the ages, the knowledge, the hidden knowledge, the occult. Now occult doesn't mean evil. It doesn't mean the devil. It doesn't mean Satan. Occult means hidden means hidden. That's all it means. So they took this knowledge and they made it occult through a system of encoding encryption, one of which is mathematics, numbers. Another is architecture. Everybody wondered why do they have a fraternal organization called the Freemasons? Aren't those the guys that build walls? You bet they do. And every wall they build contains the secrets that have been kept and maintained throughout the ages and it's encoded in the architecture and in the measurements of the buildings and in the mathematical form or formulas used to derive the geometry, the shape, the length and breadth and height of rooms. It's all encoded there. <laughs> 